Hey everyone, thank you for joining me for another video. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Lacey and this is Living with Lacey. So guys, today I decided that I would bring you along with my planning. I have not done a plan with me in a long time. One of my subscribers and my bestie, she was like, where are the plan with me's that you would do every week? I'm like, oh my God, life be life in. But you know what? I do plan every week. And so I just set up my camera and I'm just ready to go. So if you are interested in planning with me, I would love for you to get your planners out. If you feel like it or not, get you something to drink, a little snack, and we're gonna get into planning for the week. Right now, I'm only planning in my functional planners, which is, this is my, um, cloth and paper spiral that I'm using, my 2024 spiral, y'all. I'm loving it. I've been getting this spiral for a couple of years and I haven't really been consistent in it, but for some reason this year, I am very consistent this year. Also another functional planner that we'll go through is my CP Petite. I'm loving this for on the go. And then we have my HP Mini that I'm using for my ministry planner. So some of these things might cross over and I'll probably speed it up when it does, but I'm going to plan um, really everything out in this A5 spiral. Uh, this is used as my home planner. It's really like my catch-all. It's where I put everything. My whole life goes in here. The first thing I want to do, I want to go through and just give you a flip through and just tell you about how it's working for me. So this is like a little planner update as well. I will tell you so far, everything's working for me. I'm so happy with my planning system this year. I feel so good about it. All right, so this is, I think this is the color graphite. Y'all, when cloth and paper came out with this vegan leather cover, I jumped on it, but not soon enough because I missed out on the fossil that I wanted to get. And I know everyone's asking at happy hour, when are the vegan leather covers coming back? So I hope they come back really soon. But I just have, um, the pockets just has a card in it. This is just the thank you card from cloth and paper. Then I have some arrow flags keeping it very simple. I love this old world new things receipt. And so I keep this here. Uh, nothing has changed here. I still haven't written my name here, y'all. I don't know if I'm gonna write it. I said I was gonna use my Cricut, but I haven't done that either. But I love kind of making this my own. And then let's see what's next. Okay, so the year at a glance, I used my color dot so that I could differentiate between holidays and birthdays. And then after that, it comes with a, or this was extra, um, a little pouch. I do love having this because I can keep my stickers in here and all the things that I love to use. Um, I went ahead and punched this inside of here. I will, I'm gonna have to give y'all a video, something quick. I said I was gonna um, do that for a subscriber on how to use your disc punch to um, punch in the spiral. It's so simple, y'all, it's really simple. All right, so this is what January looked like. Um, I had some goals here. Nope, I didn't write my goals here this month. I said I was gonna put goals here and I didn't put goals here. I did write goals out, but this is what January looked like. No stickers, extremely functional. And I just used this little tab from CMP to write down some other things that I wanted to do. I cannot believe I didn't use any stickers, like none, dots, nothing. But I was okay with it because like I said, this is a catch-all. I'm not overly concerned about it being, <clears throat> I wouldn't say decorated, but having anything on it except for information that I need. I keep this one on my desk open so anything that comes up, I can write it on here and then I went ahead and I love coffee also I put my own little coffee um, vision board or dashboard right here and this is what the first week looked like nothing this is the second uh, week of January of course I used some of my stickers from Norris Cove that has meeting and church on it I love these that she did for me I think you can get yours uh, still customizing so that's what that looked like. That's what January 15th through the 21st looked like. 
um, I really like doing this where I section off right here, important, and I have personal church and home. It helps me to kind of identify and um, separate those important things that I need to get done for the week. All right, and then this is January 22nd. Use some of my stickers. Y'all, these stickers from Japan, they're not playing around. I mean, they're not coming off. So I did, um, this week's goal was to get the house cleaned. All right, so that's all of January. And then we find ourselves in February. Here are my goals that I have for the month. Right here, let's see, home, personal, living with Lacey, church, work and health, some important dates, and then a bill that I pay. And this is what February looks like, still very simple. Okay, right here is kind of like a meeting I had, just some notes I needed to take, and I used the sticky note. This was January 29th to February 4th, and then here we are for February 5th, which will be this week. All right. Move this out the way. All right, so the pen I'm using today is the Blend pen oh this is by zebra this is by zebra you can get this on cloth and paper y'all this pen is my all-time favorite i love this pen love this pen all right so i got my uh, sticker book all together this is where i keep all of my little functional stickers that i use y'all i'm trying to be organized in 2024 for sure all I do is get new things and reorganize I don't know if y'all do that or not but that's my testimony <laughs> new things and reorganize all right so I know that I have every week two standing two standing meetings so I'm gonna go find my meeting stickers I use these every week. I should move them up front. This um, sticker book is from Poi and Hun. Went ahead and ordered it and ordered some extras, so I wouldn't have to wouldn't have to worry. I'm gonna go with this for church. I'm gonna use these meeting stickers. What color is that? Yeah, light like cashmere. All right, so these are stickers from North Cove. So I'm going to go ahead and place this here. This meeting, I have a meeting on Monday. Oh, I have two meetings on Monday. But what I'm going to do is just, what I like to do is place you know big events over here on the side so I'm gonna put meeting right here and then I'll write out what the meeting is and then I have a meeting on Tuesday let's see now I have a meeting on Wednesday goodness gracious just love meetings okay And I have church on Wednesday as well. Just put this right here. Church on Sunday. Okay. All right, let's see. I'm looking for my ruler. Did y'all see some of those, uh, that ruler, is that a ruler? I think that's a ruler we're getting from cloth and paper. I love the way that looks. Now I got this idea from um, 25 Trails. I'm just gonna put it down. I'll put it down with her, what her um, IG is. But I like how she writes work and then just kind of stretches that over. do the same thing 
Okay. And then I'm going to use the second box for checking. I love that. Okay. Let's see. All right. On Monday, like I said, I have two meetings. I have a production meeting at 10 o'clock. In. Okay, and then I have a. I went ahead and did did a little pre planning too, guys. Um, I have a GT meeting that's online at three fifteen. Uh, for those of you who are new, I am a gifted and talented teacher in Louisville. I know this 15, 3 15 p.m., but for some reason I like it to say p.m. All right, so I have that online meeting. Um, also, that morning, I have a a planned experience. That's where I go into the... Um, kindergarten classroom I go into different really k5 k2 going to k2 and so I'll go into uh, k2's classroom and do a little teaching but on Monday it's kindergarten so I'll do that I need to make sure I discuss creative interview In the meeting tomorrow so I just need to write that down I'm going to do content planning for February tomorrow yes I'm behind still getting it done I think I'm always behind I could plan every single day I'm still gonna be behind I don't know why things just keep coming up that um, I need to do that's not on my plans I get things done on my plans, but there's some other things that, or I don't realize something's gonna take longer. All right, so that is for Monday. Oh, something else I wanna do for Monday as well. Monday evening, I wanna spend a little time journaling. I got some cute little journaling stickers too. Try to use those. Got them from Sweet Freckled. Sweet freckle design, so I'm going to put journal, because I'm trying to, I'm having a hard time being consistent with my journaling, and so I'm like, you know what, just put it in your planner, put it in your planner and try to do it, so I said I wanted to journal on Monday, because that's a day, although I have a meeting at 315, I should be able to do that in the evening time, on Tuesday, I want to be able to journal Monday, Tuesdays, and Saturdays. Just gonna try it, guys. That's all you can do. That's all I do is just kind of tweak everything. Just try to tweak it and see if it'll work. All right, I just cleaned my office, and then as soon as I started cleaning, I said, well, let me plan. <laughs> Y'all know what that's gonna come out looking like. All right, so that's Monday, and then we're gonna move to Tuesday. Okay, Tuesday, there is the meeting I have is a standing worship lead meeting at 6.15. We also have a star field test. That's what I don't want to do. So I work in Texas and the kids have to take a test and this is basically a practice test. But I don't have to give the test. I'm just like a reliever to kind of help out. All right, I am past due for this oil change. I was gonna put it on Monday and I said, nope, don't put it on Monday. Go ahead and 
put it on Tuesday. If I get it done tomorrow, great. But And then I'm going to clean my bathroom. You know what I was doing? I was putting so much cleaning on one day. Laundry, kitchen, I mean, thinking I could be superwoman. That's half the problem. I can't. <laughs> I cannot. All right. And then on Wednesday, I have a sunshine committee meeting. I know y'all are like, what is that? Sunshine committee meeting is just a group of teachers that come together and we figure out all the fun things that we can do in school for the teachers. So it's great. And then I have women's Bible study. At seven o'clock. I didn't put anything here through the day. I decided not to add any cleaning because guess what? I'm not going to clean. I'm just not. I'm going to get home late and that's not going to happen. Okay, on Thursday, I have a rehearsal. Let's see what else. I said on Thursday. I'm going to go ahead and put that over here. It's at 7 o'clock. Okay, and then on Friday, it's always date night with my husband. I'm going to say at 6 o'clock. I'm so inconsistent with these times, but it's okay. <laughs> now, I've added nothing else to Friday because this is all I know right now. And y'all know something is coming up. It's like Saturday, this past Saturday, I went to a funeral and I thought I was going to be able to come home and do all the things, and I wasn't. It didn't happen like that. Saturday, what do I have? Okay, also for Friday, I have a GT planned experiences for first grade. All right, Saturday, go ahead and put laundry down. laundry for Saturday. Also, blackout dates are due. Okay, I also said that I'm going to clean the living room and I'm going to do some filming. Now, I said the same thing last Saturday and it didn't happen. I'm going to set aside some time to film. All right, now I'm going to come over to this to-do list. Oh my gosh, I have not, I have not done my to-do list yet. And I need to get it done. Okay, put this over here. These are from Piper Paper Company. Go through here. I have some the same color, some stickers the same color, but I think I'm gonna make that kind of stand out a little bit. These are from Sweet Caress Designs. Do y'all remember when I used to go crazy? Those of you who've been watching me for a while, I go crazy over Sweet um, Caress Design stickers, and I'm feeling, <laughs> feeling like um, going ahead and placing me an order too. I've been doing pretty well on my orders. I have placed three orders and y'all will see some of those things. But <laughs> I've been doing pretty well, I believe so. I'm just gonna put it right here, skip a line, put church right here. And then after church, Shouldn't be that much. I'll put home right here. Things to get done for home or things that come up for home. Church home. Okay, I'm out of that color, but it's okay. Use work. And then personal. Okay, 
And then I need to write my to-do list. Find a little sticker that says to-do. I have enough stuff in here. Y'all, at one point I told myself I couldn't order any more stickers until I used up at least half of these. Here we go. Nora's Cove. She has great stickers as well. If you haven't checked her out, check her out. To do. Okay, last week I said I was making a doctor's appointment. I did not make it. Stuff is getting, I am getting things done this week, folks. I'm telling you right now. So to do, I need to make a dentist appointment. I think I can get all this stuff done in the morning. I need to make a vision appointment. Past due on that. I need to complete. No, I'm gonna come over here with this home. I'm gonna say complete kitchen organization. Now, where am I gonna put, I don't know. Some of it might can happen on Saturday. Some of it might can happen on Sunday. This little part right here is if I'm sitting around, I have nothing to do. These are things that I need to realize that are important and I need to get them done. For church, I need to really solidify my Easter set list. I have two songs. I need one more. I also need to work on my weekend set list. Because I lead worship this week. Okay. Also, for home, I need to water my plants. And then we need to call regarding a storage. So my husband's closet is filled with his mother's um, item. His mother passed away just about two years ago and she has so many antiques and we still have so many things. Okay. All right, I think that's it, y'all. I think that is it. And then I usually use this spot right here for Happy Mail. I'm not sure what's coming in this week, but I do have a couple of things coming in. Okay, you know what? It's okay. I'm going to write Happy Mail. Okay. All right, so this is it for the week. This is what it looks like and this will be filled in even more I'm gonna try to get you know start being a little more consistent with Instagram as far as showing the week after I finish and so yeah this is it and this is what we have so far right now I'm gonna take everything here and I'm gonna transfer it into my CP Petite because I like to have everything that I'm doing for the week as well I'm gonna flip through my CP Petite and just show you what that looks like and my ministry planner just to give you an update for that and I'll do all those off camera so you don't have to see that okay but this is perfect right it's doing good hey did y'all put tabs I went ahead like I said and used this little tab and had January here I wasn't sure if I wanted to have tabs going all the way through here so I think I'm gonna do one for February as well and just kind of write some things down that I'm thinking about completing but I'm not sure y'all let me know all right so this is my little CP Petite I love this little planner and she does go everywhere with me at one point I was just using her for notes and then yeah she just kind of transformed into something else so i have a little journaling card from cloth and paper here this says one step this is coming at a time one step at a time this is coming out in our february sub box oh y'all let me know if you're getting that box i am so ready for the box i am ready for the box i'm like when is my box coming and it seems like i'm always the last person i don't know if y'all know this or not but we're now getting these faux leather bags with cloth and paper on it and it has some saying on the front and I just love keeping all the things in here and so this one was a pretty tan next month is black and so yeah this is also a um, sneak peek of 
the card that's coming in here, like a bookmark. And I went ahead, I saw this from, oh, I can't think of her, her IG handle. I'll, I'll put it down below so you can see it. But she went ahead and punched hers and I was like, girl, I'm scared. I'm scared, but I went ahead and did it and I like it. I'm glad I did. So I love the way this looks. And I love that all of the photography was taken inside um, cloth and paper. They didn't hire anyone. It's their own people. Okay. Oh, just so you know, I keep this very simple too. All I have is schedule and notes. That's it. I'm not planning on getting anything else. Schedule and notes. This is working perfectly fine for me. All right. Oh. I'm going to pause right there. This is probably like my favorite, <laughs> my favorite little thing I've ever done in a planner because I love this moment. Um, these sticky notes, they're over here. They kind of stay close to me in the color concrete and pimento. Y'all, come on. That's cute. That's so cute. So I took a picture of cloth and papers picture that they posted. I just thought that was cute. All right, this planner belongs to, I went ahead and covered up January because it's over. I still have January in here. That's what my January looks like. I don't worry about doing any of this for the goals. I just need to know what's happening for my monthly. That's what this looks like. And then I use this kind of as an inbox. And this is first week of January. Oh, and here I also try to do meal planning sometimes. Happy meal. I change it up. Change it up through the week. But as you can see, y'all, I'm being really consistent. And this is February. This is what February looks like. And I use the new dots from Cloth and Paper. And I saw this um, this quote, don't rely on motivation every day, depend on discipline instead, because that's what it is. I'm, I'm like, I'm not motivated to do something that I know I need to do. It's like, you don't need motivation, you need discipline. Whew, I should have made that my word of the year. And this was last week, which I didn't feel that out, but it's okay. Still got my things done, taken care of, and this is this week. And I will fill this out based on what I already have. Okay, and then this is just notes back here. Any meetings that I have, I have standing meetings, and if I have this planner with me, I'll just use it. So just, and I added some more paper. And that's it. Oh, and then back here, I have this little holder. I think this is from cloth and paper and I just have um, some stickers I cut them off at the bottom so they would fit in here and that's it so as y'all can see though very consistent I'm so happy and then this is from Exquis creation I love this folio and I just I love how this looks and so this is what I use for my ministry planner use this for some meetings as well so this is inbox this came from exquisite creation the box that i received this is a quarterly overview and so i just wrote down some top goals for quarter one that i wanted to take care of year at a glance and then in this one as well i just have schedule and notes and that's all i need now to be honest i don't really need this this schedule not like this what I need is when I say schedule I don't need a, uh, a weekly or a daily I just need to look at what's happening at church overall y'all <laughs> I know some of y'all looking like that's church mm -hmm. that's called leadership 101 <laughs> these are all the the ministries that I'm over or meetings that I have or things like that yeah Okay, <laughs> let's move on. This is just for a meeting. And then uh, this is what February looks like. It's a little light, right? That's what February looks like. And I added this in here from cloth and paper. 
I love a layering moment as well. I only keep these in here if there's a week that, like the week leading up to Easter, extremely busy. That's when I'll use this. No need of using it. Just on a normal basis, weekly basis. Um, this is fo focus. Um, successful people maintain a positive focus in life no matter what is going on around them. Jack Canfield, and that's from Exquisite Creation. And these are just some notes I take. And that's it, just notes. I have notes all the way through here. Keeping up with, trying to keep up with all my ministry life. And that's it. That's it. This is very, very simple. Very simple, but cute, right? Oh my gosh, I love it so much. I love it so much. So these are my three functional planners that I use. And that's it, guys. I'm going to take everything, like I said, from here and then place it in my CP Petite. And then we will be finished planning. That is it for today's plan with me. If you have any questions about anything that you've seen or just questions in general, I'm here to help out. Um, just let me know. Just let me know. And that is it. Uh, if you are new to my channel and you're just stopping by, please consider subscribing and click on the notification bell for more videos. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget, take charge of your life one plan at a time, and I will see you soon.